Welcome to the New York State Tax Department's POA-1 application demonstration. In this short video, we'll demonstrate how to file your Power of Attorney form online. We're pleased to offer simpler, faster ways to complete your Power of Attorney with a shortened form and easy-to-use web application. To begin, log in to your online services account and select File a Power of Attorney from the Services menu located under Business Tools for Business Accounts or under Other Tools for Individual Accounts. If you haven't already created an account, visit our Online Services homepage to learn how. If you have a pending Power of Attorney, this will bring you to the POA Authorization screen. Any pending POA authorizations will appear here and can be accessed by selecting an action from the Actions drop-down menu. To submit a new POA, select Add New POA. If no pending power of attorney exists, you will be taken directly to the POA Information screen. From the POA Information screen, review the section titled Important Information Before You Begin. This section contains step-by-step -step instructions to complete and submit your power of attorney. Next, be sure to complete the POA information and additional authority sections. For help with any question or field, select the green question mark icon beside it. When finished, select Continue. This will bring you to the Grant Authority screen. Select the applicable options to grant the representative the appropriate authority for a specific tax type, case, bill, or tax period. When finished, select Continue. This will bring you to the Representative Information screen. Enter the requested information for the representative in the fields provided. When finished, select Continue. This will bring you to the Representative Summary screen. To edit a representative's information, select the representative's name. To add more representatives, select Add Another Representative. Note the information regarding Tax Department communications in this section. If you don't wish for a representative to receive copies of Tax Department communications, be sure that the Option button next to that representative's name is not checked. Or, select Clear Selection if you don't want a representative on this POA to receive communications. When finished, select Continue. This will bring you to the Review POA screen. To view information you entered, select the View button. To edit any information you entered, Select the appropriate Edit button. Once you've completed your review, check the box in the Review Complete section to agree to the certification.
To print, sign, date, and submit the form now, select the Continue Now button or select the Continue Later button and you'll be given instructions on how to complete the POA process at a later time. This will bring you to the Print POA for Signature screen. Review the Print Your POA section for step-by-step -step instructions to print, sign, and date your POA. Select the View Print Form button to generate a PDF document to print. Once the document has been printed, select Continue. This will bring you to the Attach POA screen. Refer to the step-by-step -step instructions at the top of the page to ensure that your upload file meets department specifications. You must print, sign, date, and scan the document before submitting to the tax department. Click the Single File link for additional instructions. Once your scanned POA document is formatted to meet tax department requirements, select the Browse button to browse for the desired file on your computer or network. Then, select the Attach button. When finished, select Continue. This will bring you to the Submit Your POA screen. Carefully review the information provided. To attach a revised document, select the Edit button. When finished, select Submit. On the Transaction Confirmation screen, you'll be issued a confirmation number indicating that your POA-1 has been received. You should print a copy of your confirmation page and save it for your records by selecting the Print button. Close out of the window to return to your Account Summary homepage. This completes our POA-1 application demonstration. Thank you for your interest in New York State Online Services.